Why do we get wrinkles when we age? Some faces remain youthful and almost wrinkle-free even in old age, while others are deeply wrinkled and wizened. Numerous factors contribute to whether, and if so, to what extent, we get wrinkles starting in our mid-twenties or so. There are intrinsic factors that come from inside our bodies. These we cannot influence, like allergies or hormonal fluctuations during menopause. Our genetic disposition is also an important factor. The dermis plays the decisive role. Among other things, it consists of the connective tissue fibers, collagen and elastin. Collagen is responsible for the stability of the young skin, and elastin is responsible for its elasticity. The higher our genetic predisposition is for getting wrinkles, the less collagen and elastin we have in our tissue when we age. That's how the skin loses its softness, elasticity, and structure. Wrinkles appear. Our genetic predisposition is certainly one factor for wrinkles, but far more important are external, extrinsic factors which we can influence. In particular, too much sunlight damages our skin. The harmful UVA radiation penetrates deeper into the skin and leads to the production of enzymes in the dermis, which damage the collagen fibers and thus reduce the firmness of the skin. Besides sun radiation, especially the consumption of alcohol and smoking lead to premature aging of the skin. Also factors like heat and cold too much stress, an unhealthy diet, and not enough sleep. Let us look older than we are. If you want to know what you can do against aging, check out this video.